Hello and welcome back to Furious Vengeance Gaming, a weird ass YouTube channel name place where I play video games and, uh, well, hopefully you watch. So, we're playing some more Genshin Impact and, um, yeah, let's go ahead. I'm gonna pop right, right into there. You should there. really bring the Knights of Favonius with you next time. So, I should have been recording. I jumped on for just a second, and I decided to finally go in and use uh, this thing, the Wish. Of course, the uh, the actual store where you would most likely spend money. Now, I don't know why I started off. I it started me off with like twelve of these wishes, and I also had like. 4,000 of these star points Just turns out to be um, a lot kind of in my case it was because I won big one of these is uh, this character um, you automatically get this character Noel when you get the 10 set so you can come over here and buy a 10 set and you get um, like f 9 items and the character then you've got all these other things. There's you can get this character. Um, I think five star promotion. Uh, you got to read what this says over here. Every ten star uh, wishes gets you at least one four star or higher item. Odds are it's going to be uh, a four star item, and everything else has been three star. Um, five star promotional characters can all can only be obtained in spe specified wish uh, in the specified wish during the specified time periods. Yada yada, and then there's this one. Um, oh no, not this one. I'm not thinking of this one. This is just like just the weapons. Why would you just do the weapons and not have, um, I guess the option to have these characters? So I'm not sure if like I'm selecting a different tier of item to purchase <coughs> or what, or if this is just showing all the events that um correspond when you purchase which i don't know let me see uh no it changes look at that interesting oh look at that so since i spent up my my points over here if i go over to this other page i still have points that i could use on this page oh wow so i can do some more wishes anyways the first time i went into here um uh, actually i was on this page I just got a bunch of weapons and it was like, bleh, nothing special. The second time I had enough points to do uh, this thing. So I went back to this. So I was like, oh, might as well just get this, you know, freebie character. When I got the freebie character, I got that Diluc, Diluc, this character at the same time, five star character at the, I was lucky <laughs> and I didn't. I wasn't recording, and I feel so bad that I wasn't recording. But you can see I did spend uh, the points over here, and now I don't have enough. And if I wanted to do another 10 wishes, I'd have to spend 1,600 of these star points. Otherwise, um, if, if you were to try to get... I, I would need at least 542 of these Genesis crystals. But in order to get that you have to buy these here's the genesis crystals here's where you pay money to get the get you know higher tier stuff or whatever but i'm just spending what the game gave me and it gave me the uh deluke character um and this character at the same time so those points got spent and now it's um, down to eight. But I don't know. It looks like I got some more points on these other pages. Why not go ahead and use them? So let's do a 10 wish and let's see if we get one of these characters. Again, how nuts would it be? No. Oh, it's turned purple. That's about it, though. Okay. You know, I think it does the same animation. It doesn't really, like, tease you with other, you know, things. So three-star weapon uh i already got that one i already got that one i already got probably all of these that it's gonna give me 
It promises me a four star at the least, so we'll see if see what that is. Not seeing. Oh, oh snap! I got a four star character. Another character. Oh, it looks like ice. I wonder what his weapon is. Those look like kind of like giant ice batons. So I, I don't know. Hey, we got another character. So that's three characters I just added to my inventory. I can that I can switch between. You can only have a party a party of four though. Um, and get some more of these little whatever they are. Currency used to purchase rare resources from the shop. Surplus stardust of of destiny. Perhaps it can create new destinies when in large quantities. Okay, let's just continue. All right, I don't have enough to do anymore. Let's go to this next page. Oh, and it looks like I don't have any more points. That was the last one. All right, well, let's check out these new characters. Uh, you got to go to uh, this character button. Click on that. And, oh, actually, no, that's not the, that's just if I'm doing inventory. This is the button. Characters. Uh, um, and you can see the different characters, but actually, I'm, I'm totally wrong. I gotta go to party setup. So, waiting for that to load. Okay, so we will put uh, my main character away for now, and we will swap it with this new ice dude and see what happens, see what he's all about. My demon expelling mantra is ready. Demon expelling mantra. <laughs> So now let's go to character and let's see if we can give him an upgraded weapon or not. Uh, weapons. What do we got for you? He's just another sword character. There's so many sword characters, but I do have um, plenty of fresh, good-to-go swords. Let's see. Uh, base attack 38, 39, with attack 7.7% on it. Okay, let's just do, let's do you as an attack. And let's see what his abilities are. Um, okay. I'm assuming just more ice. Oh, man. And it turns this area into like a cold zone. Interesting. Jeez, that just goes for a minute, don't it? So basically, you just like cold zone the area, combine him with another character that might interact with his element, or... Just use him on lakes, use him in lake areas. What's cool though is like right after battle, of course, you can just go straight back in and swap your character out for whatever other characters. Um, let's see, what's this quick setup? Quick setup. Um, so what? Unselect, reselect one. Um, I want to go with. Let's go with her. Keep her going. And. He uses these larger broadswords, and I got a really, I got a four-star sword that I was able to give him, so he might just be a powerhouse. And she creates shields, so I'm just going to do that. There's still a long road ahead. At the moment. It looks like you can, like, obtain these Primo Gems, whether they're from daily logins or, or specific quests. Where does it say? Adventure XP. Adventure rank 8. I'm a noob. <laughs> uh, we need to get our, our adventure rank up. So, how do we do that? The Art of Cooking Story Quests. Okay. Shovel some work. It's too high of a level for me to do. Prologue Act 2 without tears. Story arc archon quests. I'm wondering if the, those are primary quests, maybe. Uh, find Lisa in the library. Librarian Lisa seems annoyed about her work. Um, interesting. The world quest: the art of cooking. On the outskirts of the city of Mondstadt, the adventurer Lynn is currently preparing to to make a meal. Obtain quest. Oh, chest. Uh, Blech. Quest chain rewards. Interesting. Speak to Lynn. She's right here, actually. Right. 
Um, am I lost? Am I confused? Oh, there she is. Ah, is that like a quest icon above her? Not anything at that point. So, we we did the deed. We cooked. Is it done? Obscure. Yep. Mm, let me try. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Mm. Now that's really tasty. You are indeed gifted. I know this. These are the things I, I know. I told you so. <laughs> With your culinary skills, you should try more difficult dishes. I should, shouldn't I? Oh, I've got some raw ingredients in my bag. Have them in return for this meal. All Can right. we really have them? Won't you run out of ingredients? There's stuff everywhere. That's okay. You should be able to find lots of ingredients when exploring the wilderness. There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good Hunter that sells food and ingredients. Go have a look when you've got the time. Okay. Total waste of Thank money. Might as well just info. cook your own food. Oh, hey, leave some chicken mushroom skewers for Paimon. Uh, you know what? Let's keep on checking out these quests. Um, t -t 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 -t. Lapis Act 1. Glide with the wind? Talk to Amber. Amber wishes to discuss the matter of how you've been using your wind glider. Navigate. Oh, I would love some navigation. I'm the survival expert of the Adventurers Guild. Uh, nice this is an icon. You. It's in the town. Isn't there like a... Cancel navigation? There's no like real warp into the town. <sighs> Alright, well, I guess I'm just gonna... Run in here real fast. Hello. Um, no, not you. Oh, hey, it's. Hey, traveler! I've been looking for you everywhere. How's that wind glider I gave you last time? Uh, not too bad. <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you. Oh, I would need a. But then have that again, medically checked you out. don't have a gliding license, do you? A gliding license. A gliding license. Hey, don't hmm, copy me. What's that? Oh, isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to legally glide in Mondstadt. Legally? Oh man, I, I should like I might oh, I might have got pulled over on the gliding been highway. For ages now. This is the first we've heard it's about it. It's a good thing it. she's telling me about this. <laughs> yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. Everyone's noticed. <laughs> So, you came looking for us because you want to give us a gliding license? No way! The Knights of Avonius have come looking for us. rules. You need to pass an exam, and only then will the Knights issue your license. Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official gliding exam. I gave you your wing glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what Acting Grandmaster G- An exam?! <sighs> what yeah, if we fail, it's on you. Then again, Make you look bad, so Amber you better just examiner. give us an auto pass. <laughs> Maybe you can cut me some slack. It's fine, I can I'm do this. I'm sure you'll glide through it. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the day that Storm Terror attacked, so I'm oh, sure that's you'll right. have no problems. That would have been something but awesome to have recorded. you do need to respect the rules and glide properly. Oh well. Here, take this gliding manual. No need to memorize it. Just be familiar with everything in there. For example, only one person per wing glider. No carrying anything over the set weight limit. No taking off using an animal slime, and so on and so forth. Anyway, be sure to read it, okay? I Basically, had to read a load the of big, thick internal books too when Lisa already. was teaching me magic. Wow, that's a big old book. Paimon thinks we best get started. Great. Okay. Come find me when you're done. I'll be a wi- Alright, what book? Are we supposed to read a book or, or do a thing? <sighs> the Knights of Favonius Gliding Manual does not sound like a fun read. Nope. Nope, it does not. After Amber leaves, you begin to, to read the gliding instructions. Oh, that's great. When I don't really have to read the book. Wind brushed across the land. Birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They ask the animal god, how can we reach the heavens? To which the animal god replied, 
You have yet to find that which is most important. As the god spoke, the wind thrust the seeds of a dandelion high into the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge, where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves off the cliff and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal god they went to gleefully say, We understand now. All we needed was a stronger wind to fly. In reply, the animal god said, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Okay. I really like the the cutscenes in this game. Hmm. That's a cool story. But is the knight's gliding manual really written in that style? It reads like a fairy tale. Huh. <laughs> anyway, let's go find Amber. Okay. Go to the exam point. <sighs> Whoa, where in the world? Can I fast travel to that? Um, let's, yes, teleport all the way up here. Wait, was there something flying above me? I thought I saw a weird shadow. Anyways, hello. Great, you're here. Did you have a good read through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules down? I mean, I read it, but... Like it was a real drag. I would know. I've been there. I thought it was a lovely manual. It had pictures and everything. Oh, the gliding manual is super dry. I couldn't get into it at all. <gasps> Don't tell Jean, though. Really? Hmm. Paimon thought there were some pretty cool stories in the gliding manual. Cool stories? Oh, you must mean the example cases in the appendix. Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal animal slime takeoff. Apparently, if you pop an animal slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I really want to try it. But it's illegal. <laughs> no, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to learn to fly. Uh, what? <laughs> Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used to read as a kid. Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same pile and must have grabbed the wrong one when I was leaving. How in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story with an instruction manual? Yeah, how in the heck? Uh, uh this is so embarrassing. It's because, maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is the thing that truly taught me how to glide. Well, then, it's a good thing we red-watched it. What you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Uh, but anyway, let's get back to the exam. Okay. Don't be nervous. Just glide like you're used to. Okay, then. You just need that's to follow it. the marks Just glide like normal. Finish. Don't be worried. Don't be worried. Just glide like normal and you'll pass the exam. Oh, okay. There's nothing I ne I really needed to. You made me worry. Oh, oh, I'm going. Uh. Whoa, 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 whoa. There looks like there's an updraft. Taking the updraft. I'm going to go for the bottom corner because there's like a bit of an updraft sort of thing. Looks like. Yep. Whoa. There we go. Oh, oh. I think I'm too high. I think I'm too high. Boom. You need How'd it, I do? But it's no surprise given the way you handle your glider in a storm. Yeah, I'm the like. Next part of the exam is a prodigy. In See you there. Don't keep me waiting. Uh, okay. Oh, there's another what? Wait, what? Alrighty then. You heard her. Back, Back to the city. city. Let's not keep Dang, I wish there was a teleport. 
No, let's not keep her waiting. Let's go. Hey, here, over here. I'm all okay. set up. Let's carry on with the exam. Same okay. deal as before. Glide through. I'm ready. Up oh, three, two, one. Let me go. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Uh, what did I do? My camera angle was bad. My camera angle was bad. Come on, come on. Now where? Is that it? Oh wait, over there. Oh, I'm gonna fail this. Up oh, here we go. What? Okay. Oh dear. <laughs> Seems like you've got the hang of wind gliding now. Let's I, do the final stage. I guess so. Easy. You've flown this way before anyway. Once you've passed this final stage, you'll finally be able to get your very own gliding license. Just Good. keep thinking about that license. Let's Ready? go. Oh dear. I gotta climb this wall. Oh, come on. Oh, this is easy peasy. Windborne now Traveler. We're, now we're, what? You are required to land at once by the order of the Knights of Favonius. But I was just taking my exam. The Knights of Favonius. Uh, hi. Well, what's going on? Please, show me your gliding license. My gliding license is, uh, got eaten by a baron bunny. It is against the law to glide without a license. I am arresting you under Section 7, Article 12 of the Mondstadt Penal Code. Oh, my goodness. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will forever carry on the wind. Wait, okay. I'm an instructor. This is a gliding exam. Oh, I see. Well, you picked a bad time to hold your gliding exam. Really? Why? The Knights of Favonius received a report from a sister at the cathedral, claiming she saw Raptor gliding around these parts. I thought your student here must have been his partner in crime. Raptor? Raptor? Who's the- Unknown criminal Stop in Stop saying Mondstadt. what I'm saying, woman! He always uses a wind glider to commit his crimes, so people started calling him Raptor. Wow, that he makes no sense. Fast, then. So far, we haven't managed to catch him. Our plan this time was to draw him into the cathedral with a precious artifact and ambush him inside. But he escaped with the artifact. Oh, wow. Fortunately, one of the Sounds sisters crafty. put some secret markings on the artifact using elemental magic. But he was too fast, and we couldn't even keep up with the trail the markings left behind. Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So tell me, which way did he go? As far as I know, he was last seen near Springvale. But that was some time ago. Leave it to me. With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. So I passed? Once we've got this raptor guy, we'll pick up where we left off. Oh, come on. But no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with Jean. Okay. Ooh, that's going to be in an area that we are unaccustomed to. Uh, but there is a road there. Could it's not, not not like a place I could just climb up and glide out of here on. Is there? Can I climb these buildings? <sighs> Come on, get up there! Ah! Holy cow! I can climb the buildings. It's pretty sweet. Um, looks like it is that way. I don't know if our glider will last that long over the water. But, you know, there's always a time to learn. <laughs> Please don't be any giant monsters in the lake. 
Nope, nothing that way or that way. Oh dear. Okay, we made it. Just by gliding across the water, that was real fast. I almost teleported to somewhere else where we had to go by, where we would have had to go by foot. Um, press V, right? To, okay. Here's the quest location. This is Springvale. There must be some clues about Raptor around here. The sister from the cathedral put some secret animal markings on the artifact he took. Use your elemental sight and keep your eyes peeled for clues. Okay. Sounds like this guy can fly like crazy though, so I don't know what we're gonna do about it. What, what? Okay, there's a thing here, broken off branch. Ooh, hey, what do you think this is? It looks like a broken tree branch. Oh, Paimon knows, it's from a frame of a wind glider, therefore. There are no elemental traces on it. Hmm, a strip of cloth with animal markings on it. Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wing glider. Wow, Outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon thought. If this really belongs to Raptor, it must mean his wing glider is broken. So he, he won't be flying away from us this time. It's the oh, elemental hmm. mark. How do we know if this was left by strange birds? Slime. Animals. Animal slimes are airborne creatures. They don't leave marks on the ground unless someone stumped on one to take off. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by a raptor or an animal slime? Either way, let's make a mental note of these markings. They're very clear. It appears that the elemental markings point this way. Huh. Well, do you think he ran off ahead? There's only one way to find out. Come on. Go we run aimlessly in that direction. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Looks like something's going on up ahead. It sounds like there's a battle going on. Could that be Raptor? Quick, let's keep going. All right. Boss battle. Boss battle. <laughs> Come on, boss battle. It's right over here. Jeez, this guy does some damage. Thank goodness. The Knights what? of Thavonius have arrived. The hilly chills won't dare pursue me any longer. Farah, fruit vendor. What happened? I can't believe it, but the hilly churls attacked our carts. <sighs> Luckily, I outran them. Hilly churls? But I thought the Knights of Favonius had cleared out most of the hilly churl camps around these parts. It's a small camp not too far from the village. The route I take on my delivery runs ensures I steer clear of it. But today, oh, some crazy fellow suddenly fell out of the sky and landed right in the camp. Hmm. Now, who does that remind me of? Santa Claus? They really riled them up. They chased the funny-looking fellow as he fled, which brought them out funny of the Funny-looking fellow. Funny-looking fellow. Okay. I managed to get away, but they smashed my fruit carts to smithereens. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do when the merchant caravan gets here tomorrow. Funny-looking? In what way? Oh, he was holding on to something. Must have been heavy because he couldn't glide in a straight line to save his life. Maybe that's why he fell. Honestly, people like that shouldn't be allowed in the skies. It doesn't take a genius to know you're not supposed to carry heavy objects while gliding. I'm gonna report that idiot and make sure he gets his license revoked. Heavy object? The artifact? D tell me, did you see which way he went? That way somewhere uh, in that direction. I managed to catch a glimpse <laughs> as I ran from the hilly churls. I think he went that way. <laughs> Seems like a strong lead. On with the chase. Oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get back, I'll tell the knights to mop up the rest of the hilly churls as soon as possible. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, what the? Freeze. 
Jeez. Why am I getting kicked? Come on. There we go. He just goes nuts. I got careless. All right, let's find out what his Q does. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Yeah! Oh, take my power! Apart from the hilly trolls, there's a bunch of funny-looking people too. Why is that everyone's funny-looking? I'd say this lot is with Raptor. But if that's the case, what are they hanging around here for? I wonder. Well, this measly bunch can't slow us down, that's for sure. Oh, wow, he can instantly but break rock. But we also rock. haven't found the artifact, which means Raptor still has it on him. Forget these guys. Come on, let's keep following the elemental markings. Elemental markings. Uh, did I get the rock? Okay, I guess I did. Okay, so let's go in. Let's do it. Start. That's good for me. Jeez, this guy does serious damage. I wonder if it's because of the four-star sword that he's got. I was getting knocked, knocked There's around. There's only one way over there. Raptor must be up ahead. However, it looks like the only way we can catch up is if we glide. But there's a ton of enemies below. They'll definitely attack us after we take off. If we're going to do this, we'll have to glide and defeat them in one fell swoop. You okay. still had one stage to go in your exam, right? Did I? Yeah, but what's that got to do with anything? Well... How about we make this the third and final stage of your gliding exam? Okay. Are you sure that's how the exam is supposed to go? It's a custom version of the exam, designed by yours truly. Besides, the normal version of the exam wouldn't be fit for the hero of Mondstadt himself. So, what do you say? Watch me nail this exam! Watch me nail, Raptor? Okay. Prepare for takeoff. Raptor awaits you once you defeat all these enemies. Then that gliding oh, license is Oh, he's waiting yours. for me, is he? How do you know these things? Okay, so what is the... Use nearby wind currents to keep yourself afloat while evading enemy attacks. While gliding, you can drop bombs, defeat all the enemies along the way. But I thought we weren't supposed to hold heavy objects. Alright, where's these bombs? What kind of bombs? Yeah! How do I drop the bomb? Oh, I'm dropping the bombs. Dropping the bombs. There you go. One for you. Some for you. For you. I need that. There we go. There you guys go. Enjoy. Dropping off Chinese food. Um, I think that that's it. Let's go. Um. Heyo. I can't look up. With my camera, so I don't know. Oh, hey, there we go. That'll do it. And here you guys go. And you. And you guys. It's gonna kill everyone. Death to everyone. Where's my win thing? Nice! You breezed through it! <laughs> You're a natural. I knew you'd be fine. <laughs> the, the third stage of All getting your license is, is learning how to drop bombs on people. <laughs>
I'm sorry, sir. You did pass your exam. You didn't murder anyone today. Oh, Raptor! We're here for you! <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, I'm not sure. Oh, okay. I see. I see what the deal is. There you go. Enjoy. Oh, that's, that's all it was. Blow him up and then it opens the door. So, oh no, he killed our guard. Unlock the door for him. Oh, wrong person. Good thing I have like a heavy hitter. Uh. I supposed to do on this one? Disable the electric. That's more like it. Random orb key. Up oh, more appeared over there, so okay. The arrows do knock them. Oh, there we go. Knock them off completely in the back. Good thing I wasted that. Okay. Up oh, here we go. Across. Ugh, he must be around here somewhere. Amber! Over there! There's a dude. If you insist on chasing me, so be it. Huh? Who brought the little girl? You must be Raptor! You can't escape! <laughs> I don't need to escape. There's no way you can make it over here. Oh, it is pretty high. And quite far. Oh, little girl, why don't you run along home now and let your leader deal with this? Don't worry, I promise that once the Grandmaster gets here, I'll surrender immediately. <laughs> hey, watch it! You're talking to a Knights of Favonius Outrider! You'll be sorry when I arrest you! Um... Let's just examine our surroundings, uh, just like you taught me, right? <sighs> You're right. Ugh, he's right there in front of us. If only we could glide across. <sighs> so how did he get across? Wait, she can float! <laughs> but she can't carry nobody. Uh, some sort of mechanism, some kind of electrical magic, grappling hook or spikes or something. Possibly a mechanism nearby. Hmm, I don't see a mechanism, and I have good eyesight. <laughs> okay, Besides, then. Besides, there's nowhere on the cliff that you could build one. Bye-bye, kiddo. Oh, no! He's getting away! Oh, we can't hesitate any longer. The only way to get across is to glide there. But... but... Don't worry. I'm the gliding champion of Mondstadt, remember? If Raptor can do it, I can do it too. Oi, Outrider! You have less chance of surviving this than jumping off the Animo God statue in Mondstadt without your wind glider. Ha <laughs> ha! It'll take some serious guts, but it's not completely impossible. I seize your point. If you rule out everything that's completely impossible, gliding is the only idea left. Remember that book I lent you? The one I thought was the gliding manual, but wasn't? The first birds couldn't fly. Flight was their reward for their courage to plunge into the canyon. <sighs> Be my witness. 
Go, go, Outrider! Raptor says I'll never make it. But if you listen carefully... Wait! Stop! You'll never make it! Come on, off you go now. Back home like a good little girl. Raptor says I'll never make it. But if you listen carefully... The wind. The wind says I will make it. And that's good enough for me. The... Those are called voices. Don't listen to them. <laughs> a wind current. So let's just glide. And, yep. Don't know what's going to happen. What's what's a wind current? Oh, there it is. There we go. Okay, I made it here. We'll just have dilute murder people. There's no way. What are you trying to do? Uh, I am okay. Freeze. Oh, his ability is not ready. You're open. Oh, what did I do? Why did I do it? I got you cornered. Um, I. I'll have my revenge <laughs> eventually. All right, I got him. I only noticed the wind current from in the air, and it's the only one. It would be suicide to try and escape in the direction Raptor was going. In other words, the only way Raptor could have gotten out would be this way, past us. Aha! So he was just trying to fool us by acting smug, in the hope that we would just give up and leave. Little did he know, we're not so easily fooled. It was all thanks to your sharp thinking. Just like a wise man once said, once you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, no matter how improbable, must be the truth. Pretty shit, pot. Pretty sure Paimon said that. At the end of the day, gliding is seven parts technique, three parts instinct, and then 90 parts courage. What you did now looked more like 99 parts courage. Uh, it was just like in my first gliding exam. I was super nervous, but in the end, there was nothing to be afraid of, and I passed no problem. I kind of missed that nervous rush in the exams I've done since then. It just wasn't the same. Um, sorry. Paimon thought you said you passed no problem. What do you mean exam since then? Uh, well, you see, the thing is, Mondstadt is all no glide zone this, no landing zone that. <sighs> Every time I get my license, it keeps getting revoked. I must have <laughs> taken the exam about 15 times altogether. Oh, wow. <laughs> but I always pass the first time. I guess my little gliding manual ain't so bad after all. Let's go and get a copy of the real gliding manual from Acting Grandmaster Gene sometime. Sounds good. I'll head off first because I need to escort Raptor back to the city. Once you're back in the city, don't forget to come find me at the cathedral. I'll issue your gliding license there. Okay. <sighs> she just can't sit still, can she? Guess that's why she's the outrider. When this is all done and dusted, let's head to the cathedral in Mondstadt. <sighs> Getting this gliding license has turned into quite the adventure. Got some Primo gems. A ride adventure rank nine. Still need this 
brilliant diamond silver to ascend his level 20. I don't remember about marriage. Congratulations! Here is your gliding license. You're okay. officially legal now. Yay! I'm of legal age. All right. I'm not surprised though. You are a natural after all. A lot of effort. <laughs> I put a lot of effort. Yeah, it was easy. Oh, and I'll sign you up for the next wind gliding championship. Wing glider championship. I glide so fast that no one can keep up. It's just me up there on my own, gliding around. <sighs> you won't stand a chance of winning boring. if you sign me up. Oh, fighting talk. <laughs> it seems you have no idea how terrifying the championship really is. Well, until I kick your butt in the championship, I wish you a happy, liberating, and above all, law abiding gliding experience. I'd like to see you try, Missy. Make sure you obey the rules. Whatever you do, don't get your license revoked. <laughs> Is that a real thing? Like, oh, I don't, brother, why do I feel like that's not a real ask thing? Me, that's a bit rich coming from Amber. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. She had her license taken 15 times. Don't drink and glide. <laughs> ah. Violation cases. Well, they should have told me that before I took my my exam. Good thing I didn't tell anybody that I was drinking and gliding. <laughs> Alright, well that's gonna do it for this episode on uh Genshin Impact. Uh I I hope this entertained you. Uh if uh if 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 if, if you watch till the to the end, please feel free to give me a like. Uh comment whatever you want down below. And uh, please, 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 I, I need just, it doesn't hurt just to have me subscribed. I, I, I will bother you with no notifications, I promise. <laughs> so as you glide off into the sunset, my friend, don't drink and glide. We'll see you next time.